Welcome dear friend. In this video, we are going to show you how to fix Windows 10 start button not working issue. As you can see, my start button is totally dead and frozen. With no further delay, let's go ahead and fix it. Solution 1. Restart Windows Explorer. Right click on your taskbar. Select Task Manager. If in case, you could not open Task Manager by this way, please try any one of these alternate ways. If you see a limited list of tasks like this, please go ahead and click on More Details. Please ensure that you are in Processes tab. And look for a process named Windows Explorer. Right click. And select Restart. Please give it a minute for the Explorer to restart. Let's go ahead and check now. Yes, this little trick fixed my issue. If this didn't work or if you're looking for a permanent fix, then please continue with other solutions. Solution 2. Restart your computer. Well, this is a little tricky because power options and restart are part of start menu. So, I'll show you some alternate options with which we can restart. Press Ctrl Alt Delete. At lower right, select power button and then restart. Another way. Save and close all open applications. Now press Alt F4. Select restart and OK. Let me show you one last alternate restart option. Go to Task Manager. Select File. Select Run New Task. Please type shutdown slash R. Now hit Enter or select OK. Please wait for the restart to complete. Post which your start button should work normally. Solution 3. Use the system file checker tools to repair missing or corrupted system files. Go to Task Manager and run New Task Option. Type PowerShell. And most importantly, please enable this checkbox to open PowerShell with admin privileges. In PowerShell, please execute these commands, one after another. Once all done, please close the PowerShell and restart the PC. Solution 4. Reinstall and re-register all built-in Windows apps. Please copy this command from this video description and execute the same in your admin PowerShell. Post the command execution, please close the PowerShell and restart the PC. Solution 5. Update your Windows. Ensure your Windows is up to date. If you are not able to update using regular method, please execute these commands in admin PowerShell one after another. Solution 6. Windows in place upgrade. Microsoft have provided this lesser known but very useful option where you can reinstall your Windows and still can preserve your personal files, apps and settings. Please follow the steps told in this Microsoft video, the link has been provided in the video description. I hope one of these solutions helped you. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching.